Hello, and welcome to Pi. Projects, ideas, and experiments. In today's video, uh, this is going to be a little bit different. Um, I'm actually uh, having to take care of uh, some plants. Um, again, more plants. Um, we had a bit of a, a cold snap here, and uh, a lot of plants didn't make it. I, I don't cover them up. I'm a firm believer in what makes it makes it, what doesn't doesn't, as I've said before. So anyway, in addition to the, the plants that have died because of the cold and just, you know, well, kind of end of the life cycle for some plants, um, the apartments where I live have got kind of gotten on to me for things not looking so good. Um, so with that and, again, the cold snap, um, I'm going to be uh, cleaning it up. Um, we'll do a quick, uh, before shot. And then, uh, I guess we'll end up doing an, an after shot. And all honesty, I'm, I'm not gonna, uh, I'm, I mean, I may film the whole process. I'm not really sure. I mean, it's cleaning up dead plants. But, uh, it's another video to put out. And, uh, I don't know. Kind of thought it'd be a good thing to post. Uh, so anyway, uh, without further ado, let's get to it. All right, I am outside on my patio. It is currently like 37 degrees, 38 degrees outside. I really don't want to be out here when it's this, you know, but uh, making content. Uh, so as you can see, Everything is uh, pretty much dead. Most of, uh, let's see if I can get that to focus. A little bit of, oh, that didn't do nothing. Uh, pretty much everything is, 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 is shriveled up. Uh, I don't know if it's coming across great on the video or not. Um, but everything is shriveled. There is still some greenery. Uh, I believe these here are the honeysuckle, and these here that are green are the, uh, Carolina jasmine. Uh, no, star jasmine. Uh, Carolina jasmine is over here, and it's actually doing pretty good. Uh, I have, I think, some old pieces of, uh, honeysuckle that's actually growing there. But pretty much everything else is is uh, dying off. Like I said, between the apartments complaining about the dead plants and then this cold snap, uh, I'm going to have to get through, especially this jumbled mess here. And uh, let's go take what it uh, looks like from, from down below. One reason I was waiting is because I've got these nice little seed pods. I try to wait as long as I can so they get nice and crunchy. And I just let them drop and hit the dirt, hit the dirts and stuff. Different containers. See, like some of these, they're just not, they're just not quite ready yet. They've got to be completely dried. And, uh, but sometimes you got to do what you got to do. So anyway, this is, uh, what it looks like from, from downstairs. As you can see, everything's kind of shriveled up. And uh, there's some greenery, but most everything is pretty shriveled. So I'm gonna take care of it. And uh, yeah, especially, especially over here. See if I can get that angled right. Got a lot of mass of stuff there. And it's gonna make it look a little nicer. And uh, anyway. I'll get to it. All right, so this is my compost bucket. Um, these lids are really cool. Um, I'll put a link to them if I can find it. And of course, if you click on it, I'll get a little bit, hopefully. And uh, anyway, um, I like these lids. Makes things airtight, keeps everything good. Uh, so basically on my compost bucket, I just, uh, 
do kitchen scraps, you know, food scraps, eggshells, coffee grinds, stuff like that, coffee grounds, and uh, all that. And then, of course, whatever I ended up taking out of the plants, uh, go in this bucket, and then uh, obviously I can't compost it here, so I take it over to my grandma's. She has a yard, and uh, she has a compost pile, so uh, none of this is going to go to waste. I mean, I think it's a waste that, you know, people are more about aesthetics than nature, but, you know, uh, part of living in an apartment. So, get you a container to put everything in, and uh, I just have these. I know they're not in the, they're the best of shape. I don't really do much with them. Uh, that's just for, like I said, trimming everything. And uh, snip, snip, and get done. Uh, I'm going to try to set the camera up to see everything, and uh, we'll go from there. Alright, so this isn't really the, uh, the best filming angle, but uh, I'll do what I can, and uh, like I said, put it on fast forward so you don't have to suffer through it all, and uh, then we'll give uh, a little after shot. The, uh, the smell of a compost bucket. Oh. I mean, you won't be able to see the, the main sections here, but they're going to get done. Another thing is, is with the way the plants do, sometimes they uh, spread out and they reroot in other containers. So I have to be careful not to cut out anything that has survived while still getting everything that looks like, well, crap. The way I set up these bamboo poles uh, is making this a little difficult. Bye. I'm already realizing that a uh, five pound bucket's not going to be enough, so uh, I'll probably bring out a trash bag, but it will all be composted. So more than likely a lot of stuff's gonna fall downstairs and I'll have to go downstairs to pick it up, but uh like part of it. Alright. You know what? I think I'm just gonna show an aftershot because this is gonna take a long time and uh Fast forward just really isn't going to work. You may not even see this part. Or you will. Maybe I'll put it in there to explain it. Alright. Let me get done. And then I'll come back. Show a after of everything. Okay. So. I've gotten quite a bit done. Um, not quite done done. But. As you can probably already tell. 
That's so sad. Uh, so you can see behind me real quick, a giant pile of, of stuff. Uh, I tried to save as much as I could, but the thing with vining plants is they all intertwine and everything, so uh, I'll keep going and uh, show you more afterwards. Uh, during all the cleaning and everything, found out I have some, uh, I think these are some of the old uh, little trims I put of the honeysuckle and they're actually they're actually growing so that's good uh, this is actually from the star jasmine uh, during the cleanup and uh, I'm just gonna see if that actually ends up growing I hope it does uh, all right all right and here is the the after effect I personally think it looks horrible but it is what it is all cleaned up got it all just as much bulk of the dead material out as I could and uh alright let's go uh see what it looks like from downstairs alrighty so that's how it looks now and uh, like I said I think it looks kind of like crap but I'm much more for nature and the beauty beauty of nature's chaos But hopefully things will grow back, fill in, and use what's left to grow some more. Uh, and by having to clean up all the plants, all the dead plants, that means I get to plant more plants, which means more videos. Yeah, more plants. I'm not really wanting this channel to be all about plants, but kind of seems to be the way it's going. Thank you for watching Pi. Projects, ideas, and experiments. Remember, be smart, stay safe, have fun.